what's going on guys? Better be here today, aka the clock back. So I'm here with my wife. Shannon, aka Cosmic Pinks. We're here to check out Obi-Wan part two. Two, 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 two. Um <laughs> We're not gonna spend too much time talking to this one. Just go ahead and check out our reaction to the last episode. Once again, uh, thank you, Connor, so much for, uh, for editing these episodes. I appreciate it because we got a lot of stuff to record this weekend. Stranger Things as well. So make sure to uh, stick around and follow for all that stuff, man. Amazing stuff. And the boys next week and like lots of stuff going, lots of stuff going lots on. Of stuff. Lots of stuff. It's Marvel soon after that. Like it's going to be amazing. So it's going to be There's a great a lot time. Of content on the a channel. lot of content on the channel. So great time to subscribe to the channel and check out my wife's channel as well. It's either in the cards and end credits. I mean, end credits and screens. Or in the description box below. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> angry, yeah. All right, let's get right into it. Obi Wan. We'll talk more towards the end. If you're interested in the in the discussion section, I have all the chapters out in this video. So uh, yeah, feel free to check that out. All right, guys. Before we get into this, please make sure if you want to check out the full reaction to this episode and all the other stuff that's be going to be coming out. Uh, if it's not up today, it's going to be up in a few days. So check out the Patreon link. It's down below for the full reaction. I'm changing up how I'm doing things on Patreon, so it's gonna be easier for you guys to watch, and it's gonna be awesome. So definitely check out the link down below for that. So let's get right into it. So it's happening. Yeah. All right, talk about later as you normally do. Let's get into it now. Yeah. Come on, Rick. It's time to watch some Star Wars, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> you, you promised. <laughs> Man, they put the extra, but this is where the Boba Fett budget went. Yeah. Straight into yep. Obi Wan. Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord. They really slept on my mans, honestly. They did. Because, I mean, look at visually how much better this is. Oh, yeah. It's Obi Wan. They can't, he can't have nothing less. They can't slack on him. Mm mm. I miss when they would put the planets on the screen. I'd love to know where we are. Mm hmm. Oh, it looks so mm. dope. Natalie Holt slapping already. <laughs> this looks like Blade Runner, and I love it. It just looks like a Blade Runner town. Mm. This looks like Los Angeles in 2019. Oh! This is just a, just, a, just a clone. It's just a clone. It's just a clone. Wow. Bro. It's Moe Morrison really out here. You're right? Man, the retired clones, dude. Yeah. Oh my, I heard that voice. You know it anywhere. Yeah. Oh my heart dropped for a second. I was like, yeah. this we know. I'm like, Rex is chilling on the side of the, like. Yeah, right? Oh, my Lord. Was that 501st? It had the blue. Maybe. That might have been a 501st clone. There's a Jedi. He helps people. Hmm. hmm. The Jedi are all gone. Ooh. I'll take is this someone claiming to be a Jedi? Right. That's not a real Jedi? Okay, you're safe now. Oh, no. No, it's a Jedi. Is it someone we know though, or is it a new Jedi? I just want to see Cal. I know. Oh! Oh! oh. So he is a Jedi! Yeah. Man, Kumail really out here collecting Disney right? checks. He could be faking it though. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Your mind. No, he's, no. he's faking. Yeah. He's faking. <laughs> the Force is so strong with you. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Just see. Oh my God! Go. Re relax, Kingo. Sheesh. <laughs> Why is he just Kingo? Yeah, she's literally just Kingo now. Another three hundred to take you to her. Goodness, that light is unforgiving. Just <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're probably gonna sell about the first chance he gets. Mm -hmm. Oh. Distraction. Yep. Literally with ease. Just me. Obi Wan is good at espionage for the most part. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Yeah. It's been ten years, huh? Oof. Need to brush up a bit. Yep. It's been a while. <laughs> It'll come back to you. Yeah. It always does. It's nice to yeah, we never really get to see a lot of Jedi do hand to hand, so No. Everybody bleeds. <laughs> Once a Jedi, always a Jedi. Always bro. a Jedi. Mm-hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> Go of me. Wait! I'm here to help you. Where's the army? Come. 
I'm gonna get you out of here. He is the army. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so cute. I know. It's so weird seeing him with Leia like that. Yeah, so young. Kidnap an imperial senator's hmm. child. We've done worse. You have no right. I found a link between him and Organa in the. I love the eyes. Mm -hmm. Use the girl. <laughs> Bro, I, honestly, I'm glad that because in the trailers, I don't remember him having the eyes. Yeah. I'm glad that was one of my main my main things. I'm like, at least give him his eyes. Right. I feel like it wasn't fully finished. Mm hmm. 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 That's going to get real interesting. Bro, it's been a while since he's had to do something like this. Mm hmm. We got Jurassic person. <laughs> got a whole T Rex head. And she's like, gloves. yes, I <laughs> And the gloves. Maybe. <laughs> so sassy. So sassy. Love it. Yeah, she hasn't been off world. No, never. Don't touch anything. It's all new to her. <laughs> yeah, it's good to see these. How can I trust you when I know you're hiding something? <laughs> that's fair. That's that's the little. The less you say, the less you give away. Lay or gun. It's the opposite. How old are you? Right. Ten. You don't sound like you're ten. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you should know how old she is. Yeah. You brought them to the planets when you left. Mm. Um, he might have lost track of time too. Oh though. no, I know. But he said it's been ten years. Yeah. I've seen him. I've seen the Jedi. Y'all really didn't think she was going to pull something? Mm-hmm. You didn't take her with you. That's your mistake. You know how passionate she is about this. Mm-hmm. It's because she used to be a Jedi. Yeah. So she probably despises it, too. Leave you. Leia. Make a float. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's going to do it. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. He should have just made her float right there. Yeah. Oh. oh, lovely. She's uh, she's perceptive. This one. Mm -hmm. It's one of her greatest skills. Yeah. Like she hasn't. She's just going off his work. Yeah. He hasn't demonstrated anything. Yeah. Loving all the new practical creatures. Mm -hmm. God. She's so slippery. I know. Wasn't she in Rebels too? Who? That one Inquisitor there. Maybe? Yeah, she was the one that worked with the fifth brother a lot, I think. Mm. I could be wrong, though. She used the force. You're gonna have to. To save her, she might fall off the yeah. building. Just waiting to see that green saber, baby. Mm. Yeah, that's the whole point. She's just waiting for yeah. action to show up. Then she'll know. Yep. Make the girl floats! Get rid of this guy. T-Rex head. <laughs> oh no. Bro, all the man them really found him, bro. Ah, yeah. oh, great. This is fun. We're having a grand old time, aren't we? Oh my gosh. Ooh, oh, ooh, my God. God. She's insane. Ooh. Ooh. Girl, crazy. <laughs> Bro, she's already made it on the top of my list of one of my favorite Inquisitors already. Oh no, oh no. He's gonna make her oh, float. No. Mm -hmm. no, okay, she good. Oh, come on. Obi-Wan is gonna have to do it. Do There's it. no reason in hiding anymore. Everybody knows. Yeah. Say hello, no! Please! No! We know she's fine. Do it! Yes, yeah, sir, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! You know what you come gotta on. do! I know she's okay, but she knows what you gotta do. I yes, sir. <laughs> yes, bro. He hit it for so long. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Uh oh. No, she. she won't. On me. Let her go. Listen carefully. The entire city's locked down. It's done. You no, he's actually trying to help. Mm. What cargo port do you have? Yeah. Yeah. Either way, you're trapped, anyways. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Where is he? Oof. 
Oh man. Mm. Oof. Where is he? Ah, that was a magnet, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Only very few people had that skill. Mm. Ha. Huh. Miss Wendy, you had a kid you can tell us about? <laughs> right. What now? Nothing. You just remind me of someone. Oh. She was fearless too. And stubborn. Oh. Yes, you are. I'm not. Oh. Stop. All the emotions. Stop. I'm actually about to tear up. I'm not even lying, bro. This is this got me going crazy right now, man. I ain't gonna trip. Oh. It's too early for this, man. I know. She's so much like her mom. I know. Humble this humble this person real quick. Mm-hmm. People know your name for a reason, man. Mm-hmm. Lord Vader will be pleased. Oh my gosh. You didn't know. He's alive, Obi-Wan. Mm. Mm. Anakin Skywalker is alive. Ooh! Really think I'd let you take all the credit? He's, he's not dying now, obviously. I know there's, I know there's others. Hold on. That makes sense. Hold on. That he can't be dead. What? Hold on. Hold he on. Hold on. He doesn't the rebels. That don't make sense. Hold on. I'm confused. Unless they repair him or something. Yes, that would be the only way. We'll talk. We'll talk about that after. Huh. Huh. What y'all doing? Oh Lord! Ah, uh, it's not Tatum. You're gonna see him. <laughs> oh man! Oh. <laughs> oh We're gonna man. wait another week for this. Yes. Oh my God, bro! Uh. All right, hold up. I need, like, the, you know the main thing that I need to talk about. The Inquisitor. Grand Inquisitor. Yeah, because... Unless... Unless my only theory now is unless he isn't the Grand Inquisitor we know. Well, that was just a Grand Inquisitor. Maybe he was a Grand Inquisitor. Yeah, because that would be the only other thing that would make sense. To explain why he doesn't look like the same species. Because yeah. maybe they give the same markings. Maybe they give that marking... Those markings to people. That would be the only thing that got to make sense to me. Unless they have like clones of him or something. I don't know. Right. You looking it up? Yeah. Because we, we know that the Grand Inquisitor that we know doesn't die until Rebels. Yeah. That's different. Huh? He looks different. No, he looks different, obviously. Yeah, but like the markings are the same. Even under the eye? Yeah, because the, the Grand Inquisitor... In uh, Grand Inquisitor Kenobi. See? Hmm. It's the same markings. Yeah, that's the only thing that's strange. And, and the headlines are the same. Yeah. So the, the only thing... I mean... Huh, the let me only see. thing otherwise is these, like, the two lines at that part. Mm -hmm. Go to the picture. Those two lines are these ones are facing downwards. Yeah, but that's just a so, design. That's what I'm saying. I don't know if it's a Grand Inquisitor nah. or um this Grand Inquisitor from Rebels no, replacing I, this one. I'm reading the article right now, real quick, y'all, just because I need to hear somebody else's thoughts on this. Because I'm just really confused. Um, yeah, because if it is true that this is the Grand Inquisitor and they did kill these, and that's just retconning. That's yeah, that retcons season one. Season one of Wait, Rebels. Wait, was it season one or season two? No, he died in season one. Yeah, so that just retcons all of season one. That retcons all of season one of Star Wars Rebels. Yeah. Season one is my favorite season, but, but it's still, that's one of my favorite characters from that storyline because yeah. Kanan is the one that kills him. Yeah. 
Kane is the one that fights the Grand Inquisitor right. in season one of Rebels. Right. Because I don't, I don't, I don't, no, I can't, I don't want to believe that Filoni would allow that to happen. No. He was the one that spearheaded Rebels. He's very, yeah. very, like, careful about his characters. Yeah. Nah, hold on. What what does Screen Rant got to say about this? Yeah. Um, no explanation. Nah, hold up. It's presumed he's dead, but it's not confirmed. Maybe he just suffered a, suffered a wound. You know? Yeah, the retcon. Yeah, I don't know what they're going to do with this. Yeah, because the only thing would be if it's, like, a different Grand Inquisitor. Yeah, and so they, yeah I don't know. I definitely need more, need more explanation on that. Because, you know, like we've been saying, the Grand Inquisitor that we know died in Rebels from Kanan. Mm-hmm. So it doesn't make sense that, was it in Riva? I don't know. Like yeah, We're going to have to do more research on that. Yeah, because like, like, what we're saying. saying, if this, if he dies, if this is him, like, gone, mm -hmm. then, like, this literally, literally retcons all of season one of Star Wars yeah, Rebels. He was in there throughout all of season one. He was the main pro he was the main antagonist yeah. for season one. Mm -hmm. So I'm really hoping that they don't kill him off. Because yeah. like why would they I guess we'll have to wait till the next episode to see what happens with that. Like he could just be like seriously like injured. Yeah. And the, to me the Grand Inquisitor wouldn't get he wouldn't get like get got like that. Get got like that. Yeah. He's the Grand Inquisitor. Yeah. Trained by Vader himself. I don't think... Vader trained him, bro. Like, I don't yeah. think he would just get got by his own people like that. That don't make no sense. Yeah, we'll definitely have to wait till the next episode to see if that gets explained at all. I don't want to believe... Yeah, I do not want to believe yeah. that Filoni would allow this to happen. I right. really don't want to believe this or that he would yeah, allow this to happen. Yeah, that's the only thing that's throwing me off about this episode. Everything else about the episode was amazing. Yeah. But that ending is really throwing me off. Why would they yeah. want to retcon something like that? Right. Because, like... That takes away Kanan's moment in, in Rebels. Because are they trying to say that Rebels isn't canon anymore? Are they, they better to... not, because that... Rebels is my favorite Star Wars show, period. They better not try to, like, not make Star Wars Rebels canon. Because if they do something else... Because if they kill another Inquisitor in this season... Then retcon, in this show, then they're like, retconning rebels yeah. entirely, and I would freaking hate that. Yeah, it doesn't, but it doesn't. No, they 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 wouldn't retcon it because Sabine is confirmed to show up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and and Admiral Thrawn only made an even though he's a he's a Star Wars uh, character from the expanded universe stories. He plays a big role in Rebels. He plays a big role in Rebels. And so we know... Just it, like yeah, and Ahsoka, as we saw in, in, in The Mandalorian... based on Rebels. ...is based on that, and Ahsoka has a has a connection. She has, she has every reason to find Admiral Thrawn yeah. in her storyline because the last thing we saw in Rebels was Ahsoka and Sabine going to look for Ezra. Mm-hmm. And that would make sense because obviously Sabine's going to be in Ahsoka. Right. It would make sense that the two of them are going to be trying to look for, um, for Admiral Thrawn. Right. So, so I there's got to be something that got to be an answer. That's the only thing that is absolutely throwing me off about this. Yeah. I, is either has to be two things. One, he's just injured, and that didn't that wasn't a killing blow. Yeah. Two. Because another thing too. Kanan did not have that easy of a time killing him. No. Kanan no. had a very hard time killing him. So there's no way he would go out that easy. No, that's one. And two, um, the second reason, it would have to be somebody else that isn't the Inquisitor that we know. Yeah. I would like to believe that this though there was maybe a previous Grand Inquisitor. Mm -hmm. And maybe those markings They're are markings that the they give, history. yes, that mm -hmm. they that they like tattoo like on or something for the Inquisitors, because the it's like a clone situation or like a clone situation, yeah. Because the Grand Inquisitor, as we know in Rebels, is revealed to us he was a Temple Guard mm -hmm. at the Jedi Council. Yeah, you remember that? Like yeah. that was that's what he was mm -hmm. before before he was corrupted, and he didn't have those black markings on his face. Right. That was so... only added after. I wonder if it's just, like, his kind, mm -hmm. and they have him, 
doing other Inquisitor work right now. And then, or training to be Grand Inquisitor when this one is done. Yeah. So they need to be somebody else that's going to yeah. be the Grand Inquisitor. Yeah. It cannot be her. Yeah. I like her character and all, but she, they cannot make her a Grand Inquisitor. No. That's just... If they do that, it's going to really mess up everything that I loved about Star Wars Rebels right. and Fallen Order. So I, I'm just going to... I'm going to have hope... Yeah, the only way that they're gonna stress me out for the whole week. I ain't gonna lie, bro. The only way they'd be able to make her a Grand Inquisitor is if they kill her off at the end of the season. Yeah. That's the only way. Yeah. Like they make her a Grand Inquisitor, kill her off, and then the one that we know and like actually shows up. Mm hmm Yeah, that's the only way. So I guess we'll see next week if any of this gets explained. Cause everything else in the episode was Yeah. Cool. Like I loved it. But that's like for People who don't watch Rebels, they're going to be fine with it. I don't, like, they're not going to worry about that. But, you know, we both love Rebels and know what happens to the actual Grand Inquisitor that we know anyways. So that's why it's really bothering us what's going on with this. Because then it, it raises those questions. Are they retconning Rebels? Like, because all of season one, as of right now, since we don't know anything, is retconned. And that's Just from really, that moment alone. That's already, really bothering me. Already retconned season one. And yeah. it's not season one is not my favorite season, so whatever. But it is important. But it's important for Kanan's development as a yeah. character, Caleb Doom. It's important for his character because that was one of the times he fully embraces being a Jedi again mm -hmm. and takes that step and that leap for that journey. Yeah. That's the first time like he embraces being a Jedi again. Yeah. So I'm gonna hope. Well, just to get off that 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 topic, episode was great. Love mm -hmm. the new, they love the new location. Kumail was yeah. great in this episode. Um, Leia was awesome to really see. Yes. All the Leia isms and the yes. Padme isms. <laughs> made me cry a little bit when they were yeah, talking maybe, about Padme. Made me tear up a little bit. Yeah. So that was really nice. And she's talking about when he's talking about Padme and seeing Obi Wan yeah. just slowly gradually like gradually go back to the Force was also yeah. really good. No, I I love the actress they picked for Leia. Yeah, she's she great. She has the right look. She has the, the right mannerisms, attitude. attitude. Yeah, and yeah. He's doing an amazing job. Love seeing the Jedi hand to hand. Uh, that's mm -hmm. one of the things I loved about like the Clone Wars animated series, which you haven't seen, which is fire. Mm -hmm. Um. Mace Windu was really about it. He was doing open hand like crazy. Mm -hmm. He was just like, he, he he would use a saber, but this man was an like, like, expert at open hand. Yeah. So hand-to-hand -hand combat was like a thing. So it was nice to see him. And obviously Obi-Wan did it a lot in Clone Wars too mm -hmm. as well. So it was really nice to see him like handle those people with a very yeah. unique fighting style that's unique to the Jedi. Right. And even Ahsoka has adopted that style as well from hand-to-hand mm -hmm. -hand fighting. So... I'm just excited about all the Star Wars content in general. I just hope they don't... I know there's going to be some retcons. I don't hope they retcon a lot of things. Yeah. Like, that Grand Inquisitor thing is a major thing. So I'm hoping, like we said, I'm hoping that this isn't the real Inquisitor that we know of. Right. Because I feel anyone who knows Rebels is going to be upset by that. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. Yeah, there's got to be an explanation. Because I don't, I don't want to believe that. No. I really don't, because then, like, what happens to Rebels? Because that's, like, a major storyline. But, anyways. Yeah, because even for later on, it, it actually even retcons later stuff in Rebels, too, because when uh, Kanan and Ahsoka and Ezra go to that Jedi temple on, um, on Lothal, mm -hmm. and that's when... Kanan becomes a Jedi Knight because of the people who were the, of, the, of the same race as that Grand Inquisitor, mm -hmm. and he's like, "No, you're an Inqui you're, you're you're the Inquisitor." Yeah. And then that's when we find out that he wasn't really an Inquisitor this whole time. That right. retcons that too. Yeah. So we'll have we'll to see, see. but yeah. it was great. Besides that moment, it was a great episode. I'm loving Reeve as a character. I have no issue with her. I have no issue with the actor. I hope nobody takes this out in Moses Ingram. By the way, don't attack her. Mm -hmm. for anything i hope people don't do that and be like oh they bring it on this character i don't like no she's great i like her mm -hmm. she's doing a great job um because you know people always do that attack the actors for a, a plot decision that wasn't even their choice right they're just um, doing their job yeah like kelly marie Tran. i'll yeah. never forget how the community tr uh, treated her yeah. i'll never forgive the, the community for how they treated her literally because of last jedi and, and everything so anyways thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one, Clockmaster and Cosmic Banks. Out.